What's going on? My name is Kyle Harris, aka Racer Knight 99, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to another Cup Race Review, ladies and gentlemen. So it's time to review of the 2023 Yellowwood 500 at Talladega Super Speedway, round number two, race number two of the round of 12. By the way, next race will be the elimination race in the Shara Roval to see who's going to get eliminated in the playoff and also who's going to make it to the round of number eight. So anyway. Let's get on to review, but he's a Joe. So it's a Tyler Digger race, playoff race, 2023 Yellowwood 500. And as, and also, I just want to say a huge congratulations to the number 12 of Ryan Blaney. He is now a three-time Talladega winner, defeating Kevin Harvick on the photo finish with 12 seconds off the finish. I got to say, by the way, what an amazing good finish for Ryan Blaney with Kevin Harvick finishing second and William Byron finished in third, by the way. Danny Hamlin fourth. And also, Corey Wajoy finished the top five. I got to say, that was one of the best races ever. That was one of the great races because Ryan Blaney, he's been good at, at Talladega Super Speedway. He did the same thing back in 2019 with the photo finish with defeating Ryan Newman back in 2019. He won in 2020. And now, Ryan Blaney, once again, he is a three-time Talladega winner for Ryan Blaney. And a fan's to the next round of the playoff. Ninth career win. I gotta say, that was a good race all day. So let's get on to rev the review. So stage number one, it was been a clean race all, sta all day. Stage number one, er Eric Amarola starts on the pole. And then stage number one win goes to uh, to Ryan Blaney with stage number one win. And then on to stage number two, we've seen um, a lot of good cars of... Uh, Racing hard all day, you know, not with the big one, though. A little bit on, on the final lap. Actually, not the final lap. The final stage of the race, by the way, because Ryan Blaney with the stage number one win. And also, Ross Chastain collected with uh, Kyle Busch and Rick, Ricky Stenhouse Jr. and Ross Chastain out of the race. And he's going to be the bus win situation next race in the Charlotte Roval. Uh, stage number two, another clean race all day. Brad Keselowski wins stage number two. And also... If you guys saw the the paint schemes of Ryan Priest and Chase Briscoe with the Talladega Nice paint scheme, Ryan Priest throwing uh, throwing back to Ricky Bobby in the Wonder Bread uh, paint scheme, and then also Chase Briscoe throwing back to Cal Naughton Jr. in the uh, Old Spice uh, the, the deodorant uh, paint scheme. I gotta say that was one of the best paint schemes that they have for Ryan Priest and Chase Briscoe. I gotta say throwing back to the from the movie Talladega Nights. That's one of the best NASCAR movies. So I think Ryan Priest finished in eighth, by the way. Good race for Ryan Priest. Let a little bit of laps. Did a good job back in stage number one. All right, so um, on this final stage of the race, 27 to go, we've seen the collective with Brett Keswowski and Austin Dillon and Ty Gibbs. And then um, after then 17 laps to go, debris happens. And then also, let's get on to the finish, by the way. I got to say... Once again, another photo finish with Ryan Blaney with the win. He's a three-time Talladega winner. And guess what? He's guaranteed to make it to the next round of the playoff with the win for Ryan Blaney. I got to say, good win for Ryan Blaney. Advancing the next round of the playoff. He's a three-time winner at Talladega. And next race will be the Charlotte Roval. The road course racing at Charlotte Motor Speedway next race for the final race of the round of 12. To see who is going to win at Charlotte uh, Roval next race. And also guaranteed to make it to the next round of the playoff. So anyway, ladies and gentlemen, congratulations to Ryan Blaney with the win. He's a three-time Talladega winner. Next race will be the Charlotte Roval to see who's going to win. And also who's going to be out of the round of 12. We're about to find out what's going to happen next race. So anyway... Hope you guys enjoyed this video, by the way. Ladies and gentlemen, hit the like, hit the subscribe button, click the bell when you turn it on. If you guys are new in here, ladies and gentlemen, Rob Road to 2,000 subscribers. Love you all the bottom of my heart. And don't forget to keep it rich. I love you. Have an amazing day. See you guys next time. But also, by the way, before we end the video, did you guys hear that Rick Allen said, Blaney Harvick, Blaney Harvick. There you go. Rick Allen said, Blaney Harvick. When, we, when Ryan Blaney and Kevin Harvick on the final lap of the race with the with a great photo finish. I got to say, that was the best calls for Rick Allen than what he said. Blaney Harvick. Blaney Harvick. There you go. That was one of the best calls. So anyway, 
Uh, keep it rich. Have a great day. See you guys soon. Have an amazing, awesome day. See you guys next time.